Hello guys, in this video we will be discussing some important problems based on the chapter surface areas and volumes. So in this, the first question we will discuss, this is asked several times in the board papers, okay. The diameter of a metallic sphere is 6 cm. The sphere is melted and drawn into wire of uniform cross section. If the length of the wire is 36 meter, find its radius. So the diameter of the metallic sphere, it is given. Okay, so diameter of the metallic sphere is given. So it's basically melted and it is converted into water, a uh, wire which will be in the form of what? Cylindrical, correct? Which will be in the form of cylindrical. And so, so volume of this will be equal to what volume of the wire, correct? Because this whole sphere is melted and it is drawn into, uh, it is made into or we can say it is converted into a wire of a uniform cross section. That means the volume of sphere will be equal to the volume of cylinder. Okay. So, so we will discuss first what will be this. So, we can say what is the given data over here diameter of sphere is given that is 6 centimeter so that implies what will be the radius d by 2 that is nothing but 6 by 2 what will be that 3 centimeter so radius of the metallic sphere is nothing but what 3 centimeter so we have to find the volume of sphere also so volume of sphere we can write it as what volume of sphere so volume of sphere formula is 4 by 3 pi r cube so 4 by 3 into pi into r is nothing but what 3 cube so i'll get it as what 1 3 1 3 get cancelled then 3 square is 9 9 4 is 36 pi centimeter cube is the unit now why am i writing pi here why am i not substituting the value of pi here because uh, any anyways it is equal to the volume of this is equal to volume of this there it will get cancelled so it's better to keep the pi value as it is that means pi as it is correct now moving on to the volume of wire we'll find out so volume of wire which is equal to what what will be the volume of wire wire volume will be see it is basically cylinder so cylinder volume will be what pi r square h correct what is pi pi i'll keep as it is what is r here r is nothing but we have to find the r because it is asked to find the radius of the wire and v h what is h value here h is nothing but the height so h will be what see here <coughs> It is given if the length of the wire is length means what for this length will be height of the this thing so height is given as 36 meter but the case is that it is all in what data is in centimeter so you have to convert 36 to centimeter that is 3600 0, 0 centimeter one meter is 100 centimeter okay so i can write h as 3600 0, 0. why because length of the wire is given that is nothing but the height of the wire correct cylinder so pi r square 3600 okay now we know that this sphere is melted and drawn into this thing so i can write hence from the given question according to the question volume of sphere is equal to volume of wire correct volume of sphere is equal to volume of wire what is the volume of sphere 36 pi correct 36 pi which is equal to volume of wire is pi r square into 3600 so this pi this pi get cancelled now what is the remaining thing this i will take that side so r square will be equal to 36 by 3600 36 by 3600 so that will be equal to see 36 hundreds uh, 1 by 100 so 1 by 100 is r, r square so r becomes what so from this i can write r is equal to 1 by 10 because under root of 1 is 1 under root of square root of 100 is 10 this is nothing but centimeter from this i can write it is something but 1 millimeter because because why because see 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeter okay 
so from this i can write what is one millimeter that is one by ten centimeter correct so from this data you can write that is nothing but one million or we can leave this data or this answer till here also no problem 